Welcome back to the channel. Hope you're having a wonderful, magical, amazing, beautiful day. We are back with Bocce the Rock Season 1, Episode 6. That's right, Episode 6. We are carrying on with the show. We are at the halfway point now, or coming to the end of the halfway point. Uh, but before we get into that, let us introduce ourselves in case you are new to the channel. My name is Rusty. I'm Astronomy. And together we make Astronomy. 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 <laughs> we are Astronomy. <laughs> 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 Yeah, like I say, we're back with episode six now. Uh, really digging the show. You can see the growth in the characters, uh, obviously, especially with Bocce, uh, pushing ourselves to new limits in terms of her social anxiety or breaking through those barriers. Has some knock-on effects with the, like the throwing up at the end of the last episode. Obviously, some other stuff as well, but now she's got to deal with the whole selling five tickets to someone to meet the quota. Don't know if we'll see that or if that's just something that happens in between episodes. Like as a joke, you know, towards the end of the show, t towards the end of the episode. Hopefully we do get to see it because that'll be quite interesting to see how she deals with it. Forcing her out of her comfort zone to meet new friends because she kind of stumbled into this relationship before the others, didn't she? I'm not quite sure. Like, it's a slice of life, so it's kind of really unpredictable. You can't really predict what's going to happen in this situation other than them growing as a band together and making music. But like, other than that, like you can't really predict what's gonna happen. Should we go check it out? Yeah, but before that, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any future Bocce the Rock episodes. And check the description below for our Patreon where you can find early cut, early access, and- Exclusive content. Yeah, that. <laughs> I always forget exclusive content. I do do it some days. You do do? <laughs> okay. Do do. <laughs> he said she do. said do do, guys. Anyway, let's grow up a little bit. Let's uh, revert back to our adult selves and tell you to check out the playlist if you want to catch all previous reactions to Bocce the Rock down in the description below and up here as well. <laughs> okay, let's not grow up. <laughs> <laughs> Growing up sucks. It, it does. Don't do it. You should do it. Only in the right way. Grow up in terms of paying your bills, but don't grow up in terms of your personality. Just have fun, because life's too short not to. It looks like a chicken nugget every time I first see it. <laughs> oh, a chicken nugget. This guitar is my friend. But you can sell it a ticket, though. Now oh, we're doing a full recap. Okay. A full ass. Half of well, here's half a recap, season. Guys. <laughs> 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 this guitar mascot. Manager's authority. It's like a boss. <laughs> I like the recap. It's, it's not an ordinary recap, is it? <laughs> I didn't yeet it into the sea. Okay, so yeah, we will pick it up from the last episode. Five tickets. So we got the family. Yeah, that's what I thought. The dog can't come, that's what yeah, she just no, said. Yeah. yeah, okay, makes sense. <laughs> Only two tickets. Need three now. <laughs> Again, I love these little animation styles to represent what's going on in her head. They're awesome. Oh, it's bothering my eyes. It's pixelation. You've gone 16 bit. <laughs> Liar. <laughs> she does have friends. All she has to say is, I do have friends. They're just in the band. Yeah. So she never told her parents of her issues at school. Or her own issues in general. Probably not. It's quite sad. <laughs> Wonderful drawings. Oh, the Sailor Scouts are in a band. <laughs> oh. My lord. That's one way of handling them out. So I'm guessing she'll be feeling the pressure just to back out entirely because she, she's too scared not to reach the five. They would never do that. I feel like if she said to them, like, I have three tickets that I, I don't have anyone to sell them to, I'm sure they would have been like, well, I can we can help you, like, split it up between us, the three. Ooh. 
A new person. <laughs> what a coincidence, eh? Okay. <laughs> Chuck her in the sea. Plenty of water there. Who is this girl? <laughs> Asking for rice and porridge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Just coincidence. When she needs friends, one just pops pops out of thin air. Oh. Maybe hey. this person has two more friends as well, hopefully. The protagonist <laughs> plot armor. <laughs> Oh, look at a little tough. She did give me uh, Dragon Maid vibes then, as well, for the tough. <laughs> Hair of the dog, yeah. Sake? Girl! Jesus! Calm down. <laughs> I mean, you look underage too, to be fair. <laughs> she plays the guitar? Grown up. Yeah, this would be definitely intimidating, especially someone who's drunk. That's never what would happen. <laughs> She normally has that face when it her anxiety kicks in. Oh, I'm going to get a little bit <laughs> she seems, she seems <laughs> nice enough. Maybe a bit of a mess. She doesn't need lessons. <laughs> or maybe, maybe she could. Where are they then? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Of course. Classic rocker. Lessie. <laughs> so she hasn't been to sleep. <laughs> Poverty gap. <laughs> I was going to say, maybe she has a lot of problems herself. Maybe when she said, I drink to forget. But no. Poverty problems. I guess it's a real thing. But, you know, it's not the one you was expecting. It's ugly. Don't do it. Jesus Christ. It's a show as like what she would be like if she drank a lot. Oh yeah, it did say, didn't it? <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><
sounds like something I'd do. You gotta have fun with that. You guys do that. So yeah, the thing is, I have crippling anxiety. <laughs> but again, it's another person inadvertently pushing her outside of her comfort zone, which is ultimately good for her. Mm -hmm. And she'll have that type of she'll have that type of anxiety as well now, where she doesn't want to dis disappoint this person, so she'll feel like she has to do it, even though she feels like she can't do it, mm -hmm. and she'll ultimately do end up doing it because the mind works in a funny way, doesn't it? <laughs> the brain is funny like that. <laughs> Yeah, so they kind of know now. See that? She's wearing orange. Her yeah. hair is red. <laughs> okay, I'll have another look now. Mm, okay. I'll let you have that. Thanks. Raccoon, raccoon people, yeah. But Pochi's so fun. I didn't know she gave that impression. She's always been like a, you know, anxious. Pachi, pachi, pachi. Guitar no reshu to kawa isho ni shite kurerun desu kedo. Demo, watashi no tomodachi to ohiru tabeyou tte sasou to mou dame de kyoushitsu ni itte mo inakute. So, I guess this is Bochi law now for the rest of the band. Oh. Random nice people. It's already rocking it. Like her sound sounds very 70s as well. Well done, Bocchi. Sobered her up as well. Yeah. <laughs> I guess she's always had the impression that people wouldn't like her music. Mm -hmm. Even though Ochu has told her otherwise. <laughs> There we go, picking it up, spread the word. よいしょ。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> I'll sell the other ticket to this person. <laughs> Stop us. <laughs> Can't imagine they bust a teenager for that. No. Just tell them to clear off. I knew that she was going to buy her ticket from her. Yeah, it was obvious. From the moment she fell down in front of her. Animal Crossing! <laughs> <laughs> it just really sounds like that. Somebody tells me we'll see her again down the road. Maybe at the concert? Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's nice and she probably is a good player, but she's a little bit of a mess. Pretty. So pretty. Those are really pretty drawn fireworks. Mm, she did it. Yeah, maybe a little bit. But it's no fault of their own, they just don't know who or what she's like, mm -hmm. in that sense. Boom. Well done. Well done, Boshi. 
yeah, it's just another episode with personal growth, personal development for her, being forced and put into that scenario. No anxiety. Sometimes you just can't say no for the fear of disappointing and getting backlash from it, I guess. I don't know if anyone else feels like that or has been in that situation. Let us know if you have. But like, I mean, put her on that pedestal and forced her to go out there and do it. Yeah. And though, even though she was extremely nervous and showed it, that the, the people, the, 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 the girl there that showed encouragement that really did help her, like performing in front of people, they're not going to hate me, you know? Because mm-hmm. she still hasn't done that. She performed in front of um, Big Sister. Yeah, she um, hasn't performed in front of a crowd. And then she was like really fulfilled after when she opened one of her eyes. Yeah. I was like, wait, is this what people look like? Like, do I get to see faces like this when I'm performing? Like, they look so happy and they look so excited. Yeah. And so it really motivated her. And the, the best thing about that as well, she sold two tickets to her family members, but she sold the other three based on her performance. Yeah, it's all well and good for like, family members to come out and support you, and that's really nice. But they're doing it because, you know, they want to support you just as you, not because you're doing good music necessarily. Mm-hmm. Um, so that the fact that she went out and performed and people liked what they heard to buy the tickets to come see the rest of the band, and that'll be a massive confidence boost. For me, if that was me, come on, yeah! I yeah, wonder yeah. I wonder when they're gonna find out that she's like Guitar Hero. I feel point. like they're gonna find out eventually. They've gotta clock it. I, like, I, was it this episode or last episode? The last episode, episode, they showed her yeah, like a video of her. And it's just not her face, it's like but it's like pose, everything else is the same. Same guitar, <laughs> same hair, obviously. Yeah. Like how they've not clocked it. But I was saying in that, like maybe because since she's been doing this band project, that she hasn't been making her own music. So maybe there's, there's no posts going up. So like normally you put a post up, you get notified of it and mm-hmm. you see it. But maybe, yeah, maybe she's not been doing anything with the channel for them to get the notifications. And they like, oh, wait a minute. Because it's out, at the moment, it's out of sight, out of mind. So that's probably why they've not Maybe. clocked it. So. It's so weird. She gets like a bunch of views. How is she not getting paid? <laughs> I know. Yeah, because she's a teenager. She can't get paid. Oh, they have to do it in her parents. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know how that works. <laughs> maybe that maybe that O-Tube doesn't have monetization. Maybe. <laughs> but yeah, it was, it was a great little episode. I'm really enjoying the development of Bocce. Just mm-hmm. coming out of her shell. Like to, from episode one, where she was just really lonely and really sad and like no friends. Now she's got this, you know, these bunch of friends, people who enjoy her music. And she can perform outside in a crowd now, kind of. A little bit. Now like, she's got to make many friends there. at school. I feel like that'll probably be more about the next episode. Get her to be social in friend groups at school now, because like they said, oh, when she's in the when she's in the, the cupboard, um, she's like herself. She's more relaxed, more calm, more happy, and like you, you can tell it through her music. When I invite her to sit with my friends, she's like, no, she vanishes. So maybe maybe something like that. Maybe that's the next hurdle, one, or one of the hurdles. Maybe not in the next episode, but definitely one of the next hurdles to get over. Oh, let us know what you thought about this episode in the comments below. We always enjoy what you got to say. If you did enjoy this reaction, then be sure to hit the like button, smash it in the good old face down below. And if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss more Bocce the Rock episodes. And if you guys want to hang out with us beyond the videos, want to keep up to date with what we're doing and such, then join the Discord. The link is in the description. If Discord is not your thing, then check out our Twitter accounts and you'll find us talking about random stuff there. And if you want to catch the full length reaction to this episode, then check out our Patreon where you'll find this on the tier free. And as always, thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your company. And we'll catch you on the next video. Bye! <laughs> Ryu from Street Fighter. Bye! No, Naruto. Was that it, was it? No, okay. it wasn't. It's goodbye from me and it's goodbye from her. We'll catch you on another one. Bye!